Hi, now we're going to speak about ordering parts. s makes parts processing faster and convenient. In the previous video, called Adding Vendors, we figured out how to create a vendor's database. You may watch it if you haven't done it yet. Now, let's order some parts. Open the workflow and choose a case you want to order parts for. Double-click the case card and case details interface will be opened. In the bottom part of the screen, you may see all estimate lines for the case, automatically imported by Estwis from an estimating software. It contains both parts and labors needed for the repair. We are interested in parts, so click Parts tab. To order some parts, firstly we should choose them, so tick the corresponding checkboxes. Now, go to the top and click Order button. At the top of the open window, we can see the list of the parts we want to order. If some parts were chosen by mistake, click the X button at right to delete it from the current order. Estwis automatically sets part price that's listed in the estimate, but you also can customize it. Then, make sure the scheduled receivement date is correct or set the value you need. The last step is to choose the proper vendor from the list below. Sometimes it's a bit difficult to find the vendor in the list if you have a huge amount of them. In this case, you can start typing vendor's name in the search field, so the list below will be filtered. Note that Estvis allows you to make an order from multiple vendors at one time. Choose as much vendors as you need. All of them will receive message with the link containing all the information about the parts needed as well as vehicle data. As soon as you click Save button, Estvis automatically sends the corresponding message to all vendors you've just chosen. To view which parts had been already ordered, go to Ordered tab. Here you can also change scheduled receipt date for some parts if it's needed, or upload the ordered parts list to Excel file. Make your business process convenient and effective with Estvis. Thank you for watching. If you have additional questions, feel free to email us to support at